Welcome to my channel. This is another time-lapse video of an Ala Prima portrait. This is of Warren Hawke, who plays Captain Giconde of the USS Excalibur in the Avalon film universe. Uh, and forgive me, I forgot to turn my camera on while I was doing the initial drawing. I will say, though, that it's very much like the other drawing I've done. Um, there's some more Riley rhythms here than usual, just to try to capture different parts of the form and the different planes of the head. Uh, initially, I did have a drawing that was a little too um, forward-facing. You can see this is a little more three-quarter, so I had to make some adjustments, and I do that just by using a Q-tip to sort of wipe away some of the lines I use, and I, I draw in paint, so it's a lot easier to, to sort of wipe it away that way. Uh, and I'm starting off with the shadow. There's some really, really interesting shadows and highlights and bounced light into the shadows here. Um, you can see I put a very simple background in rather than trying to paint parts of the film set, which are behind Warren here. I just went ahead and made that very simple abstract, but still try to capture, I think, the essence of what those colors meant. And uh, just working from dark to light in the shadow sections, uh, you see I'm leaving some parts of the shadow off where there's reflected light in it, and I'll go back and fill those in later, even though uh, in terms of value, they're actually still quite dark, except for some of the very bright spots. Um, I, uh, I still want to leave them out because, honestly, I didn't want to change brushes and, and having to mix that color because it's a very cool highlight. And there's some really warm highlights on the lit side of the face. Um, this is a lot of fun to do because, the you know, again, the lighting was just so awesome. You know, I just love having this kind of dramatic light to work with. And uh, it just made it a lot easier. The, the, the structure of the head is just easier to capture when you have a, that kind of help going on with the shadow part. And you see me here adding some of the highlight colors. And they're still very dull until I add just the very brightest parts. And that's all you really need to do is capture those parts. Uh, if I painted them as... as sort of broadly as they appear to my eye, then when I look at the painting, it'll look overly bright. It'll look like I have overdone that highlight. So I, I try to minimize that so that I'm not um, kind of overdoing that. And the result of that uh, now I think is more organic. And now I'm working on just the shadows in the uniform. Um, and I'll just go ahead and fill that in and try to make a uh, a good match for that color. The, the, the color on the actual photograph is very shiny. Um, I'm not exactly sure what the material is. Uh, I didn't quite get that level of detail in the coverage here, but I did try and make sure it read like a garment. Um, uh, I just wound up putting some highlights in, and again, some of the color from that background is reflected in those highlights on the uniform, so we try to capture those as well. And this is the final portrait. I hope Warren likes it. If you like this video, please click the like button. Uh, please subscribe and set your notifications as well. And that can be found on the internet at robertosuzuki.art and Instagram at roberto underscore suzuki underscore art and on Facebook at fb.com slash robertosuzukiart. Thank you.